Today is the day before I go to Vegas. Tomorrow, I'm not just gonna be going to Vegas, but I'm actually going to be staying in one of Vegas's five-star hotels. Now you might be wondering, Turner, why are you filming the intro a day before? Well, I'm filming it the day before because tomorrow we're leaving super early and I'm not gonna have time to film the intro. Slowly packing our bags such as shoes, clothes, and just other stuff. It's literally all I wanna say for today and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Okay, it is now the next morning. It's 5.48 a.m. I already took a shower. Let's start driving to the airport. We then started driving to the airport, we saw an airplane, and then we kept on driving. There was a lot of flooding because of a hurricane. Then we got to the airport, did all the TSA security stuff, then we took off, and we started flying forever. It was kind of boring, but then we're getting close, and then we finally landed. And that's the Las Vegas sign, by the way. After five long hours, we finally arrived at our hotel in Las Vegas. Let me give you guys a tour. As you walk in, you got the nice full kitchen here. You know, your normal kitchen stuff. In the living room, and over here we have a nice view. Let me show you guys. The pool, and we got the cool mountains in the background with the desert, and then Las Vegas is somewhere that way. You walk into the bedroom, we got a nice bed here, normal stuff for a bedroom, such as TV, closet over here. Jacuzzi inside of the bedroom. This is a really big jacuzzi, by the way. And then we walk into the bathroom, we got the toilet, the shower, and for some reason there's two sinks here. You know, normal shower. So yeah, that's the full tour of our hotel, and now we're gonna go to the grocery store because there's no food in this fridge. Let's go now. We took an Uber to the store, then we saw this cool sunset next to CVS. We got our groceries and another cool sunset, which I took with my phone. We are now back from the store, and I'm so tired. I already took a shower, and look at this. We actually have a full fridge. I'm about to go to sleep, so I obviously gotta set up my bed. I'm gonna sleep there, and my mom is gonna sleep in that bedroom. This is the pull-out couch, by the way, so I can sleep even better. But before I set up the bed, let me show you guys this cool view again, but at nighttime. There's the pool down there with the other buildings, and then maybe, maybe not, you can see the cool lights back there. That might be a little bit better view, but it's pretty cool. So let's set the bed up now. The bed is made, and I'm super tired. I'm in Las Vegas, so... I'm just gonna go to sleep and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning for day two. It is now the next morning and right now I'm just eating a plate of frozen blueberries. I think they taste better when they're frozen, like they just taste so good. But later I think we're gonna be going to some shows, but I'll keep you guys updated. I then took another Uber to go to the strip. By the way, we take a lot of Ubers in this trip. So right now we're next to the slot machines. And yep, those were the slot machines, all of them right there. A nice garden, that's my friend by the way. We went to an indoor fake sky, then I bought some t-shirts, and then we went back down to the strip and back into some Italian indoor place. It was really cool. And yeah, that's me by the way. Soon we're going to be going to a tape face show. That's him right there. He's actually in America's Got Talent. Me and my friend then played some ping pong, which was really fun. As you can see, I'm super good at ping pong. Played some pool in the game room. That was also fun. It is now the next day again, and right now I'm just doing some homework for school because I'm not going to school today because it's a Monday and I'm in Las Vegas. Soon, one of my mom's friends are going to take us on a long drive all the way to the Grand Canyon. It's like a four-hour drive, and we're going to go all around the Grand Canyon. It's going to be so fun, and of course, I'm bringing you guys with me just, just for YouTube. Let's begin driving there. My mom's friend then took us on a long drive. We drove through the mountains of Las Vegas, saw signs, Boulder City, a bunch of desert, and I've never seen desert before. That's actually Lake Mead, and that's the Hoover Dam. I made it to Arizona for the first time. As we're driving through Arizona, I noticed that there's literally no difference between Nevada and Arizona. It's all just deserts. Now we're next to the Grand Canyon with my friend inside of an Indian teepee. Can't believe this is how they used to live. And over there is the buses that we get in. That's how we drive around the whole entire Grand Canyon. That's how I got here. And this is the Grand Canyon where there's an average of 12 people that fall off and die every year. But good thing that wasn't me. But I just looked at the cool places and helicopters. It was really cool there. Well, this right here is supposed to be like some kind of western village for cowboys and just old type of movie stuff. I mean, it looks pretty cool. Like... It looks like a western village because it is. It is a new day and it's actually our last full day. But we do still have some time tomorrow because we leave at 1 p.m. tomorrow so we still have the whole morning. But anyways, today we're just gonna go to the Las Vegas Strip again and walk around through some hotels like the Pyramid Hotel. So 
Oh yeah, let's go. Then this is the Pyramid Hotel, which you always see. And then this is a Titanic boat. And then I bought a new pair of vans. They're white, by the way. I saw another Pyramid Tower, which is really cool. America's Got Talent. We went inside of another luxury hotel. And then we went back to the Pyramid from the other side. And this is Las Vegas trying to be like New York City. We went inside of a giant four-story M&M store. It was really cool. I actually bought a pen there, which was kind of cool. This is me inside of a Coke bottle. Here's a picture. More of downtown Los Angeles. And then this is Paris. I guess people that can't go to Paris just go to Las Vegas. And this is the moment I've been waiting all my life to drive in a Tesla. Yeah, you heard me right. The person that came to pick us up was in a Tesla. And then we quietly took the Tesla back to the hotel. Okay, so today is the next day and today is the day that we're leaving. So I'm just getting everything packed and ready to go because I don't want to leave anything here. Yeah, the next clip is going to probably be me driving to the airport. So I'll see you guys there. We got to the airport and waited forever. Like this is me sitting waiting forever. Then we took off. Flew for a little bit. This is Tampa, by the way. And then we landed in Orlando. Now I'm back home and I'm super tired. So I'll see you guys next time.